Hey YouTube, I'm here in Trona. This is my 1989 Camaro that John John and I are working on putting a, a 5.3 into. So let's see if I can get this one put somewhere up on the concrete pad today and maybe start pulling out the old 305. All right, so since it's been a year since I even looked at this thing, I'm gonna go ahead and unlock the doors and everything. I'm gonna do a quick walk around. Typical wear on third gen seats here. Oh, we got free water. I'm sure they're still good, you know, sitting out here in Southern California. Oh, we got some trash. Uh, a free, free Hello Kitty pillow. You know, just, just message me and pay for shipping. I'll send that right to you. Used to have a radio in it, but I didn't lock the doors for the first couple months here, and someone did actually steal my radio. You know, Trona. The engine wasn't stolen at least. Could have done us the favor of removing it though. Would have been nice of him. You had yourself, so you got an idea. Well, this car was rimmed with it. It looks like it. I wish it was still that color. It's pretty. I just wanted to show you guys this real quick. You know, in case your vehicle starts overheating, all you gotta do is drill a hole in there apparently, and you'll be able to get to the needle to push the needle back down to a cooler temperature, problem solved. And the people who stole my radio, I also just noticed they forgot the remote. Suckers. All right, so the plan right now is we're gonna, or we're working on jumping the Camaro because when I parked it a year ago, it actually did run. I'll try to stay away so it's not too loud. But, so we're gonna try and drive the Camaro all the way around the block up to the front driveway rather than trying to move one of these cars because I mean, the Malibu doesn't have wheels. The Triumph isn't gonna move. The, those two have wheels, but we really don't want to move them. And we're trying to make sure it's on concrete somewhere that we can get to a cherry picker. Um, so hopefully, I know the gas is going to be bad, it's a year old, but hopefully we can get it to start and I can get it to drive a quarter mile up to the front. And then, with any luck, I'll see you there. Well, I might as well try and give it a shot. Well, that's a whole lot of nope. 20 minutes later. All right, I got tired of waiting for it to jump, so I went ahead and stole the battery out of uh, the wife's truck. Sorry, babe. I only need it for a minute. Let's see if I, let's see what happens. That worked for a second. Never ran good, but now I need it to run for a minute. Yep, pretty sure that uh, tachometer is out of a V6 or something because I'm definitely not spinning it to five grand. Any 
luck. This is the last time it'll ever run on this 305. Brakes work. That's always a plus. Oh yeah, to the floor, what a monster. Boy, it sounds bad, it's knocking or something. Almost trying to idle. Better in park. Nope, definitely still coming out. Goodbye, 305. days later hey guys as you can see it's clearly a, a different day I stayed really late the other day and actually got it done unfortunately the camera died so I'm sorry I wasn't able to get any footage of getting it pulled out but just want to show you the 305 is out of the Camaro it is ready for a heart transplant so today I'm just gonna Organize everything get the engine out of the garage over here where I had it stored and That's probably going to be the end of this video So for all three of you watching, you know Thank you um, please consider liking and subscribing and We'll see you next time Drive fast look cool